Hello, this is Norwich Up, and welcome to a Ultimate Team Player Review. Today, guys, I've got Ricky Van Vorswinkel. He plays for Norwich City in the Barclays Premier League. He used to play for Sporting, but now he plays for my team, Norwich. He's Dutch as well. He's got 74 pace, 73 shooting, 54 passing, 72 dribbling, and 73 heading. He's got a four star weak foot and three star skill. With he's six foot one. He's got 15 goals in 10 games for me. And overall, there's nothing that jumps out of you about his card face stats, but they're very, very solid in the mid 70s. So, this is the team that I'm playing him in. It's a budget Netherlands squad. I did do a squad builder on this yesterday, so if you guys are interested in that, I'll make sure I leave a link at the end of the video and in the description. So let's go have a look at his key in-game stats. They are 83 finishing, 92 penalties, 83 reactions, 73 strength and 84 attack positioning. His prices are 711 coins on the Xbox, 413 on the PlayStation 3 and on the PC 480. So those are his in-game stats in full on the screen and the prices as well. We're now going to have a look at some of his key goals and key um, assists as well. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. And while that's happening, I'm going to talk about his um, in-game stats in a little bit more detail. So first, his pace. His pace is very, very good. And it does feel around the 74 to 75 mark. Now, that's not, nothing amazing. It's not like Welleton and Manike Pato, all those very, very quick players. But it's solid. It can get past defenders. He can outmuscle defenders as well because he's got 73 strength in game which is very very good he's tall as well at six foot one so he's got decent pace good strength he's tall and which is just a perfect combination so overall he's very very good he's also got very very good attack positioning there you guys can see a great run there and a great chip over the keeper he's got good attack positioning so if you've got a pacey winger um like i had uh, lukaku and Elia, uh, they're very quick. So basically, you can just uh, run down with them, put the ball in, and Van Vorsvogel will be there because he's got great attacking positioning. So he's a very, very good player. I do like him a lot. And that might be because he plays for Norwich, but also, guys, he is a solid player. So um, if you guys are looking to buy him, he's so cheap as well. So I do highly recommend him. Let's go and talk about some of his in-game stats in a bit more detail. So let's talk about his ball control. 73 ball control and 77 balance, which is quite good. Nothing absolutely amazing you know, from some of these crazy informed players, but it's solid. It's good for a non-rare gold. His dribbling is very, very good. Look at that dribbling there. Gets past two players and just smashes that in off the post. He's got 76 dribbling in-game. As I said, very, very surprising. I thought it was a little bit better than that, maybe up to 80. So his dribbling was a very, very surprising part about his card, but it was also very, very good as well. We're now going to go ahead and talk about his shooting, the main part about his card. He's got 83 finishing in-game, which is great. That means his finesse shot is going to be really, really good. And there was an example of his strength, actually, to get Pajia Pereira, uses his strength and just puts it past a Buffon, I think. So, great bit of strength there. That 73 strength and at 6 for 1, the tallness really shows. And uh, that was a nice goal from him. He was my attempt of a skill run. Um, but it did fail. A good shot actually to make uh, the keeper put put that in for a corner. But overall, not a bad attempt. But guys, there's a few more things to talk about. 68 long shots and 79 short power. Not amazing, not terrible. The long shots isn't good. I don't recommend trying to score any long shots with Van Vorsfinger because it won't go in. His 79 short power though is decent, so that's not too bad. But in my opinion, finessing with him would be more um, of chance of getting a goal. His heading is quite good. You did see a header there. I wasn't really crossing in too much. Uh, I was trying to just get the solo goals from Van Vorsvinger. So that's why you only saw one headed goal. But when he did get that headed chance there, he took it well. So his heading looks okay. His passing is poor. 67 short passing and 46 long passing isn't good whatsoever. So I don't recommend uh, playing him at a cam or centre forward. Just because the passing would just uh, really won't work well at all. And there's one more thing to talk about. His four-star weak foot is very, very nice to have, which means that you basically can shoot on either foot and there's going to be a good chance of going in. Three-star skill moves isn't amazing, but it's not too bad whatsoever. I don't really skill, so I don't mind too much, but I guess if you're a skiller, then you might not want Van Vorsvinkel in your team. But let's talk about the pros first. Firstly, he's got great finishing. As I said, 83 finishing in-game means his finesse shot is going to be good. His dribbling is decent. Uh, not amazing, but not bad whatsoever. It's one of the surprising parts about his card. He also plays for an amazing team, Norwich. You guys know all about Norwich, how amazing they are, so that's why... I had to pick him up, and that's why he's not going from my club whatsoever. 
His cons, he's got medium, medium work rate. That's not too bad. It's not ideal. You'd like high, low or medium, low. And sometimes you have to wait for him to get up the pitch. And sometimes you're left with no striker when you're going for a counter attack. So that is one poor part about his card. Another poor part is his poor passing. 54 in his card, 67 short and 46 long. Not good whatsoever. So that's why I don't recommend playing him in a cam or a centre midfield or a centre forward. Playing the striker and he's very, very clinical in front of goal. Thanks for watching this player review guys, if you did enjoy it make sure you leave a like rating down below. If you have any suggestions to how I can improve my player reviews, leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.